Alright, please welcome to the stage, Jordan Hamilton! It was supposed to be coming in hot. <laughs> it, it, it's my catchphrase. <laughs> anyway, uh, before I start, a little bit of background about me. I'm gay, uh, but unlike most gay people, I also have a straight persona. And if my lovely assistant Bin would hand me his hat. <laughs> Thank you. This is how I channel him, and I call him Chad. <laughs> hey guys, stuff. <what's> <laughs> hey, how you doing? <laughs> So you'll know Chad because I speak in a deeper tone of voice and I wear the hat. <coughs> anyway, the first thing I want to talk about is straight guys in the washroom. Because when you go to a urinal, the, the, the next guy over sometimes will look over at you and be like, Sup, bro? My penis is out. Why are you trying to talk to me? <laughs> Get the hell away! That's weird! And then it drives me crazy when they're in a stall. They're doing their business, and all I can hear is <gasps> <laughs> They're not shy. It's even worse, I went to New Zealand once, and I swear, it's like established dominance or something. <laughs> they always apparently have this thing where, when they're doing their business, they wait politely for everyone to leave before they continue. Guys, don't do that, no. Man, I don't know what he's talking about. Sometimes I just really gotta take a shit. <laughs> and if you don't grunt, I mean, it, it doesn't come out right. <laughs> and when I'm taking a piss, I, I, I get lonely sometimes. I just want to have a friendly conversation. Is that so wrong? <laughs> Second thing I want to talk about is um, being gay. Dating apps are absolute hell. I've tried them all, but unfortunately, the one that's most popular right now is Grindr. <laughs> It's a giant cesspool. <laughs> I know this because etiquette is not quite the same as in the real world. For example, you can never start a, start a conversation with hello. You need to send a dick picture. <laughs> and then um, when you're finished talking to someone, you send a picture of your butt. Like, that's how it works. Hello's a dick pic, and then ass is goodbye. <laughs> also, Grindr is apparently the one and only place it is socially acceptable to tell a stranger you're masturbating. Oh, I get random, like, messages just saying, hi, and I respond back, how are you doing? Oh, not bad, I'm just jerking it. <laughs> no, don't tell me that, it's fucking weird. Somehow, once in a blue moon, you get a date with someone. I don't know how, but they break the golden rule of dating. Men, you all know it, you never mention a past girlfriend. <laughs> Guys like to break this rule all the time. And, and back me up, ladies. Like, once a guy does this, because they become like roughly 50% as attractive as before, roughly. Well, holy shit, guys. <laughs> no, is he for real? Like, girls don't like that? That's why Jessica slapped me. Okay, this, this makes so much sense. I've got to try this. <laughs> You are the most gorgeous woman I've ever seen. I've never felt this way before. You're almost as gorgeous as my ex. God, God damn it! <laughs> no, no, she's totally into it though. She's totally into it. This works. Okay, uh. Okay, I was supposed to end this here, but apparently Chad has one other thing to, to talk about. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen. I found something in Jordan's room the other night. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> the contents to which have been speculated many times by Bill O'Reilly, President Trump, every Republican ever. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the gay agenda. <laughs> Socks with sandals. Okay, that's understandable. I can get that. <laughs> Destroy the institution of marriage after legalizing it for gays. <laughs> this is taking a turn for the worse. After allowing reality TV stars to become world leaders, RuPaul will be elected president. <laughs> Do you guys understand? This has already happened. Trump is president. 
once all democratic governments have been taken over, penis size will be mandatory on all forms of government ID. <laughs> Length and girth. <laughs> National anthems must be written by Beyonce. <laughs> when all countries have fallen to the rainbow empire, anyone caught kissing the opposite sex will be sent to a work camp. <laughs> this is dark, guys. We've got to stop them. We've got to. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Why are you looking at my stuff? Oh my god! Know us, you want to get to know both Jordan and Chad and any of the other performers here tonight. We'll we'll also be single. Exactly. <laughs> and uh, we'll also be accepting donations. We'll throw that in there. Uh, if you have a little bit of money, you're not doing anything, but we'll take that. Uh, but uh, yeah, so thank you guys so much for coming out. If I could get my performers up here, we're going to do a little bow. So, yeah, exactly, right? Exactly. All right. All right. Getting here? See you later, folks.